I really hate to be the one to have to tell all of the eligible bachelorettes this, but Odell Beckham Jr. is now most definitely a taken man. No, he hasn't married his girlfriend Lauren Wood, but they are expecting their first child. Basing things off of their social media posts, it seems to me like neither of them could possibly be more excited. And after the past couple of years that Odell's had, he's probably all in on a fresh start. After being traded from New York to Cleveland in 2019, his do-over in Cleveland didn't take the way both he and fans were hoping. He was waived by the Browns partway through the 2021 season and then signed a new one-year deal with the Los Angeles Rams worth a guaranteed $1.25 million, which Odell will be taking in Bitcoin. But with all these changes, where on earth is Odell living these days? In this video, we'll be checking out where he and Lauren currently call home. In these videos, we don't reveal any addresses, and even though I've done a house tour of my own place, please do not show up at any private residences because it's not safe for anyone. You know how they say that sometimes the universe works in mysterious ways? Well, I think that's doubly true for Odell Beckham Jr. Not only will he provide a lift to an already loaded Rams team, he's been a Los Angeles citizen for a while already with an absolutely gorgeous home located on the eastern seaboard. He is now sharing this spacious abode with the soon-to-be mother of his child, Lauren, and when they're not recording a boatload of workout material at their home gym for the gram, then they're packing up to spend $5,000 a night on a romantic African safari trip. I mean, with a current net worth of about $25 million or more, we know that Odell can certainly afford it. Hey guys, it's Kara the Vampire Slayer, back with another exclusive house tour here on Famous Entertainment. This one looking at where Odell Beckham Jr. and Lauren Wood call home. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit me up on Instagram to chat. Now let's get into this video. Before I take you all inside the LA home of Odell Beckham, first I thought we'd take a few moments to experience how the other half lives on vacation. A little over a year ago, Odell and Lauren booked a trip to the country of Rwanda where they holed up in a luxury hotel known as One and Only Gorilla's Nest. Now, outside of that baller name, the resort's website vividly describes their location in the following way. Cushion in the foothills of the breathtaking Virunga volcano range along the northwestern frontier of beautiful Rwanda, one and only Gorilla's Nest is the closest resort to Volcanoes National Park and the region's ultimate luxury retreat. Alright, yeah, I can see how that might sell someone on a visit. The volcanoes are all dormant, so no worries there, but the views, those are deadly. Odell and Lauren not only shacked up in a hotel room that cost them $5,000 a night to stay in, but they also shared images of them going on safari and hanging out with gorillas in the wild. I mean, the place had to be called Gorilla's Nest for a reason, right? Of course, coming back home from vacation is always a drag, but then again, if you're living in a home like Odell and Lauren's, how much of a drag could it really be? Specific details on Odell's Los Angeles home are extremely rare and hard to come by. He's been somewhat willing to show off his abode online, but he's never let slip where in LA his home is located, for how long he's lived there, or how much he's spent on it. With all that being said, let's start with the exterior. From the sky, this baby looks like a certified industrial compound, and you'd be forgiven for thinking that it's a clinic if you drove by and all you could see was the outside. Odell's home is the only structure on the lot, and it's surrounded by a ton of open desert space by the looks of it. That means he's got oodles of room for three primary things. Park a pool, and his very own football practice field. Over on his practice field, he's constantly recording himself putting in the work to get ready for all those high leverage games. A lot of the times, Lauren will even join him out there, I assume to help keep him motivated in ways that only she can. Of course, with as talented as Odell is at athletics, his field is multi-purpose, and one side of it even has a basketball net set up for him to throw up shots in a unique way that only he and maybe a couple of other people in the world can. On the other side of the home, Odell's pool isn't the only refreshing spot out back. He also recently had a custom-made stainless steel Aquora soaking tub installed to help with his recovery from a recent ACL surgery. Of course, when he's not participating in outside activities, the other thing that Odell or Lauren can do is simply roam the ground. I know, that doesn't sound all that exciting. 
But here's the thing. When you're walking around Odell's home, it's more or less like taking a leisurely stroll at a beautiful island resort. Move inside and soon enough you'll come upon Odell's kitchen, one that appears to not only have all of the necessary stainless steel appliances, but a sturdy marble island for all your food prep needs too. The question is, does Odell bring in outside help to run the kitchen or does dear old mom take care of that for him with her super secret jelly recipe? Hey, there's no cooking like home cooking no matter how rich you get. When it comes to his master bedroom, we don't have much details. The one clip I could find of Lauren waking Odell up for his birthday looks to me like he spent the night sleeping in the living room. I mean, that's definitely a couch he's sleeping on, right? It's gotta be. And I'm not gonna touch on why Odell might have spent the night before his birthday alone, except to say sometimes, well, we all need our space, right? What I do know is this, Odell Beckham Jr. has one of the largest closets I've ever seen. I mean, it's basically a department store. I know he tagged that video with the phrase spring cleaning, but really, that's above and beyond anything of the sort. Still, storing an enviable collection of fashionable goods in a room with blue backlighting is super cool, even if it does look like a place where shoes go to die. Just outside of that closet space is a massive entertainment room that features dark towel flooring, and personally, I'm going to take to calling this Odell's Ballroom. Why? Well, outside of his trademark jersey collection turned art pieces, the room is jam-packed with arcade machines for skee-ball, basketball, and pinball. It even has a ping-pong ball table. Oh, and there's also a Pac-Man machine in there, but calling him a Pac-Man ball didn't really roll up the tongue all that well. Moving on, the one space in Odell's home that most definitely gets the most exposure is his home gym that comes complete with pretty much any piece of training equipment you could possibly want. Featuring concrete floors with some green astroturf thrown down for a pop of color and massively vaulted ceilings with exposed wood trim, the aesthetic of this home gym is all over the place. It somehow feels both endearing and a little bit sterile to me, but regardless, both Odell and Lauren are in here working out constantly, separately and together. Man, no wonder these two are in such unbelievable shape. Of course, with Odell now joining the 7-3 Los Angeles Rams, he's going to have to be at the top of his game to help contribute towards that championship everyone is looking for. If we're being honest, his first game didn't go so well. But hey, when you bring on a star like him, it's a feeling out process at first. Here's hoping now that Odell is playing in the very city he has called home for a while that he can finally settle down and focus on winning the Super Bowl. So now we've taken a look at where Odell Beckham Jr. and Lauren Wood call home in Los Angeles and where they like to go on luxury romantic vacations. We'll see how things shake out both on the field and at home with the couple, not to mention their soon to be born bundle of joy too. But in the meantime, what did you think about where the star athlete lives? While we don't know all the details, you can get a pretty good idea. Be sure to let me know your thoughts on the home down in that comment section. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram to chat because I love hearing from you guys there and knowing that you're liking these house tours. I'll catch you all in the next video. Bye.